Hey guys, Pro Dr. Sudak here and welcome back to another Roblox video. Today I'm gonna show you how to get Dynamo's Bandway lore that looks like this, you can see it on screen right now, in the game Heroes of Robloxia. Yeah, link will be in the description down below. You join the game, a link will be in the description down below as mentioned, and if you can see the missions up here, the comics collected and missions completed up here, then you know you're in a server that works. Now just pick a character, it doesn't really matter, I'm gonna go with the speed one, and go into this big house to begin with right here. When you get inside here, you will get over to this panel, and here's where you can select the mission. So go to missions, and then select the bank heist bus, the first mission in the game. Then press play solo, quick join or rooms. You can play with other players if you want to, I'm gonna go solo because that's a bit easier for now. So when you get into the game, it will ask you to select a power. I suggest you go with the strength one, you can sw switch whenever you want, but for the beginning part of this mission, it's much much easier to go with the strength one. So you get in here, walk straight forward and you will get a quick cutscene. When the cutscene is over, you gotta fight these baddies right here. Now I'm just gonna speed this up because all of the fights are basically just this, <laughs> it's just punching them, so it's really straightforward. Once you've defeated all the baddies, another cutscene will play and this door will open right here. You walk in here and there will be another cutscene as well. And here we go with some more baddies, I'm gonna speed this up as mentioned. Right, when you're done with those baddies, walk out here and some more will spawn. Again, just some more fighting, so we're just gonna get speeded up. When those are done, there will be a cutscene that removes this fence. Just walk straight through this street right here, and you will soon get to a bus. At the bus there is another cutscene, so we are just going to watch through this. And now just walk over to the bus. And then press E to punch a hole in the bottom of the bus to get through. Alright, and then you can pass through here. And here is just that you switch power when you are done fighting these baddies, so we are just going to get through this quickly. Perfect, so here we swap power to the speed one, and if you hold shift you can go much faster, and we're gonna head over to the destruction or construction site. Here there are some baddies, but we can skip past them because we are going for the comic. Alright, after that little cutscene, you can go all the way over here, and this is where you will find the first comic right behind here, look at this. This is what it looks like, it's a little Heroes of Robloxian comic, this is the location right here, you can see. There, now it's been registered so we can leave the game and hop on to the next mission. Alright, we're back in the lobby, as you can tell this is 1 out of 5 up there, so now select speed again, head back inside and we're gonna go for the next mission. Just walk up to the panel, then press missions, and then go over to Toxic Taste uh, Takedown, the mission is 2. And play solo. Alright, we're now in the second mission here, I suggest you start with the strength character. You'll spawn right in and you'll get a cutscene when you walk forward. When you then walk straight forward, they will spawn a bunch of baddies, you just gotta defeat all of these to get into the factory. Alright, we've now defeated all the baddies, and so now go up to the door and press E to just punch the door in. Awesome. Alright, then here we get a cutscene, so just wait for that to be over. And when the cutscene is over, go to swap your power, go to Tesla, and then shoot that little box over there with your electricity by clicking. That will activate the bridge you can get over. Here some more baddies will spawn, I suggest you switch power to strength, unless you're playing with other players because then you can work together. But the strength one is actually the best one to take out enemies, so I suggest always use that in battles. When you're done with those baddies, head this way and there will be another cutscene. After the cutscene, press swap power again and go to overdrive, because he can jump over this thing and get all the way over to this button right here. Click that to activate the bridge and then get on with it over here. 
After that cutscene, go to swap power once again, go to Tesla and then shoot this little box right here to deactivate this toxic gas. Then head forward. Here there are some more baddies, so I suggest again switch power to Captain Robloxian. When you're done with those baddies, head over to this pipe and press E to hit it away. Then go forward and there will be another cutscene. Here you want to swap power once again to overdrive so you can jump over this toxic waste and then press this little wire thing right here to deactivate the gas. Now we can head forward and there will be more baddies to so switch to back to Captain Roblox. When you're done with those baddies head in here and this is where we will find the next comic. Alright so after the cutscene you just want to head up this way. Now it could be easier to use overdrive here, it's up to you, but I'm going to use Captain Robloxian because I'm already on him. And then right here behind this barrel up here you can find the next comic, so collect that and then wait for it to register up here. And when that is done you can leave the game and head to mission 3. Right back at the control panel, press missions and then go to Museum Mayhem mission 3. Alright, so here we are in mission 3, I suggest you start with Captain Robloxian in this one. Alright, so at this level you just want to walk straight forward and you will have some baddies over at the museum after this cutscene. So we just want to defeat these, again I'm just gonna speed it up. When you have defeated those baddies, head around the corner and you can go right into the museum. In here head to the left and then swap power to uh, Tesla and then run over to the electricity box, you can actually jump past these enemies right here. And then press E on top of this to stay away from their little spot right there and that should activate the wire. Alright now head to the room on the other side of the museum and there will be another electricity box to activate. Again you skip past the baddies and then you jump on top of the box to avoid getting damage and press E. Now that that is activated the door will open allowing us to continue through the level. So when you get in here there will be another cutscene. And after the cutscene press swap power and choose telekinesis or kinect. Then walk over here and press E. Now you want to jump on top of this and jump to the smaller barrier and press E again. That way we can cross over all the way to here. And here we get another cutscene. Then after this cutscene a bunch of baddies will spawn so switch power to strength. Once you have defeated the baddies the next door will open so we can pass to the next room. In here we can find the next comic all the way to the left, right here. Grab it and then avoid the baddest for a while while we're waiting for it to register. And there we go and now we can leave and head over to mission 4. Back at the control panel press missions and then take the purple pearl mission. Then start. Right in here select overdrive. Because this comic is straight at start, you can just run over to this car right here after the little intro cutscene. And then grab the comic right away. Now we just gotta wait for it to register. And when that's done, we can head over to the last mission. Alright, head over to missions, then go to the second page and select a Cosminus Chaos and then press play. In this one, press speed and then wait for the cutscene to play. And once that's over, you just want to head straight forward this way and you will find the, the last comic right behind this little wedge right here. Perfect. We will now just need to wait for it to register and we will get the badge. There we are, look, we now got the badge and we got Dynamo's Bandolier and that is how you get it! 
So if you all found the video helpful, I want to give a huge shout out to Simply YT. I will leave a link to his Twitter down below in the description. I also want to give a shout out to Top Blocks. They both helped me a bunch with this mission. It was super super helpful. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please leave a like down below if you did, and don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications to so miss any of our future videos. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye. Top hat blocks, dead bird, and even Ethan Gamer. That's the homies when they get together. It's wild. Now watch them take another win. I'm talking Island Royale. Duck, duck. Mr. Duck. Subscribe now.